Hi and good morning beautiful Libras. Happy Sunday to each and every one of you guys. Thanks so much for all your likes, your comments, your subscriptions and welcome to you new subscribers here. We're getting really positive energies for Libra. Let's see if the universe can reveal anything new for Libra that Libra will benefit from knowing spirit. What about Libra? What about Libra? Ooh, right off the hop. Says embrace the flow of life. This is full moon in Gemini. Attuned to the divine new moon in Pisces. Last quarter moon in Aries. Work through your feelings. Last quarter moon in Cancer. Take a breather. Maybe you are on a breather with somebody. Attend to the details. So this Virgo energy, last quarter moon in Virgo. Last quarter moon in Capricorn. Leave the past behind. Last quarter moon in Leo. Lighten up. Be proud of yourself. Last quarter moon in Taurus and full moon in Libra. Find a balance. It's nice that spirit brings your energy into this. Yeah. Somebody needed to get a reality check. There's probably some separation here. And you're just embracing, going with the flow here. Tuning into the divine. You know, um, working through your feelings. It's like, it could have been very emotional going within solitude leaving the past behind things are starting to lighten up and be proud of yourself you found some type of balance or you're finding balance back in your life let's see what the universe has to say for libra energy it's telling you to be proud of yourself leave the past behind Pay attention to the details, work through your feelings, attune in to the divine. It's about going with the flow, the ebb and flow. Yeah, somebody needed to get a reality check with the volcano. So there's been some sort of tower that obviously needed to happen to give someone a reality check. Maybe it is about fire energy and passion. Oh, celebration. Going within. Creation. Dream time. Time to dream and create. You could have taken a time out to get healthy again. This is a very vibrant, vibrant time. Synergy. The green man. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Somebody is like... This could be pushing down their emotions. And this is why spirit is saying to bring your life into balance. You could be burying things deep down within you. It is time to get um, is this that you've buried your emotions? Getting grounded again. Going with the flow, the river. Yeah. There's a volcano and a tsunami as a wake up call. Full moon in Capricorn get a reality check so somebody is getting a wake-up call a, a reality check and i think that it was things i don't know it could have turned you cold do you know what i mean whatever has happened has been major and 
Spirit is saying you're getting grounded again. You were still for a while, but it's time to get healthy and get moving on something you're, you're celebrating and it's something you're creating for your life. Groundedness back here. Peace. Synergy. Getting in tune, in balance again. It's getting moving again. Blessings. Huh? Shaman. Ancient healing wisdom. So you are healing, definitely. But know that whatever is going on here, this person is getting a reality check. They're being um, hit with a volcano and a tsunami. A wake-up call. Who? Three cards indicating that going on I think you're getting your passion for life back I think you're celebrating I think you're creating things again for your life healthy thoughts the green man is in nurturing healthy blessings coming in got a reason to celebrate hmm. Believe in the magic. It's all done for a higher purpose. You are cherished by the angels. Protected. Embracing enthusiasm. Shouting out to the heavens with happiness. You're a wise leader. You're a beacon for others. And it is something you're celebrating here. Watching clouds. Lie back. Rest. Relax. It's like a new day dawning, a beginning of a new cycle, first light. Grace and gratitude. Through gratitude, joy expands. Breaking trail. A breakthrough is at hand. Trust. There's a divine plan. What about Libra? A new cycle, a new day is dawning. You taking your power back. Libra, what is going on? Well, where is Libra with justice? You are a wise leader. What is this? Breaking trail. Here's the chariot. What is this love here? Hmm. Somebody's getting a wake-up call. A tsunami. A volcano. A reality check. Look. <laughs> One, two, three, four cards all saying the same thing. Hmm. They could have been out sneaking around cheating. Why are they wanting who dealing with the devil? Some toxicity. Hmm. Ignoring the signs. Ignoring what the universe has gotten. They took leadership. They headed straight to the devil. Hmm. They're getting a wake-up call. Heavily burdened. Oh. They're reaping their karma is what they're doing. Spirit's giving them a reality check. <laughs> In a big way. Things that were hidden. Things that were submerged. You know, thought they could hide things. Well, they were foolish because you were divinely protected and cherished by the angels. They wanted to be this player back and forth energy. And you took your power back and you walked away. See ya. You can leave all your... And I think that they're being hurt now. I think that they're being challenged. I think they're going through chaos, conflict. Hmm. And you are worthy. You gain, you're cherished by the angels. What the hell? There's new love. Someone's in love with you. And this is what it's saying. You're divinely loved, cherished, honored, respected. 
you spoke your truth, you meant what you said, you said what you meant, and look at this, the star, healing, shamanic journey, transformation, you've ended a cycle, it's like too much confusion, illusion, I don't know, there's good news coming in, it's things going with the flow, you're being guided in a different direction. This is co-creation. This is things you're working on. Projects. Maybe you've teamed up with the universe, obviously. Hmm. Things are being made balanced and fair. You've learned to set up boundaries. Hmm. It's the sort of truth. A new day dawning. A new beginning. Communication. A victory. You're trusting your instincts. What is this? Could even be a silent victory. You may not know what this person's going through, but you are victorious here. It's a spiritual situation here. I don't know. They were entertaining third parties. If they're sitting there waiting, waiting for the karmic wheel or... What has changed? Everything has changed. You're on a new cycle. Wheel of Fortune is in your favor. This is also karma. What comes around goes around. You took this brave leadership back, took your power back. And that's what is changing everything. That's why you're being blessed. Blessings. A breakthrough is at hand. These are blessings infinite abundance it's looking like oh what's this there's a king of pentacles who wants to make some kind of offering to you somebody broke your heart there's a soulmate coming in this could have been your soulmate that broke your heart it could be a new contract you're being offered a new contract Hmm. Is it a trap or is this fear of being loved again? Are you vulnerable to receive this new offer? It's stable. It's the 1111 card. It's the path to returning. They've gotten a wake-up call. Or it's someone from your past life or someone you've already met. Working on something. Somebody self-sabotaged their own union. You've closed out a chapter. Somebody wants to reopen a chapter. It's ended painfully. Ten of Swords to the Ten of Pentacles. Boom. What the hell? I'll say they're getting a wake-up call. Nine and Ten of Swords. They're getting a reality check. They're being hit with a volcano. They've been hit with a tsunami. A wake-up call. Getting a reality check. What the hell? Something about passion. Something about manipulating, in it to win it, jealousy, envy, feeling defeated, tried to make you jealous, Empress, figured they could manipulate you, trap you. This is infinite abundance, guys. Spirit's asking you if you're open or vulnerable enough to receive this new offer. It's a King of Pentacles. It's going to make you very happy. Oh, but there's an Emperor hiding behind that. Mm -hmm. hmm. Someone has gotten a reality check. Look. 
Virgo energy going within, doing the work. What's going on? Missing you, missing Libra. A breakthrough is at hand. Someone's in love with you. You've been very loving and nurturing. They're feeling ashamed. They've been brought to shame. King and Queen of Pentacles. Emperor, Empress. Judgment, justice. There's that wake up call. Jeez, man. Spirit's not messing around here, guys. Someone is getting karmic wake-up call here. That's the universe judging this person, putting them through towers, a wake-up call, a reality check. Ooh. Hmm. They holding on to. They're stuck. Maybe they've been enlightened. <laughs> oh my God. Nine of Pentacles. Rest. Recovery. They refuse the call. the hell is this? Wanting to communicate? I don't know. This is wish fulfillment or being selfish, choosing another lover. Or you're getting a choice of love here. Oh my god, yes you are. Someone sees you as their ten of cups. They're watching you. They're observing you. Hierophant. I think somebody wants to come in. Has made a decision to come in. Breakthrough is at hand and here it is. They want to come racing in. They want to apologize. Somebody does want to apologize. Learned their lesson. They've gone through all the stages. It's going to be your call, but obviously this past person wants to come in again. They have learned their lesson, Spirit is saying. But are you too angry? Spirit is saying if you are not willing to be vulnerable to this union, then that is your choice. You're glowing here. But there is a breakthrough. I think your past person is returning. But you got to be open to it. If you've got anger issues with this person still, you're going to have to make that decision because you got to let go of the anger. If you want to make this work and if you're not willing to be vulnerable to this person again, you will know that. But Spirit's saying they're coming in. Take care, Libra. Libra. 